court's business dealings with the daughter of a casino owner linked to Chinese triads has raised questions in other states about their suitability to operate a casino. And that concern has not been lost on Massachusetts regulators. MGM Resorts doesn't believe their business dealings in Macau will reflect negatively on their suitability to operate a Massachusetts casino. Hong Kong businesswoman Pansy Ho is a partner of MGM Grand Macau. New Jersey regulators required MGM to cut ties with Ho to continue their casino license. Ho is the daughter of a controversial casino owner who has been linked to Chinese organized crime. By contrast, Maryland regulators have not required MGM to sever ties with Ho. And I think Maryland looked at our overall business practices, our associations, and they, like our company, our compliance committee, were very comfortable with Pansy Ho. As the Massachusetts Gaming Commission reviews the financial viability, integrity, and suitability of casino applicants, they called on casino executives to talk about their overseas operations. Casino owner Steve Wynn insisted any allegations of crime at his Macau casino are false. When you press them, and you say, is there any criminal activity going on in my company? They shut up because if they said it, they couldn't prove it because it's not true. And I would sue them from here to next week. The commission says business dealings overseas and the decisions of other state regulators will factor in their decision to issue a Massachusetts casino license. That's the whole point of a background check is to see whether or not there are any significant relationships between people of suspect character, particularly criminals. Yeah, so we will be looking hard at any such possibilities.